In this video, you will see me build the entire bikini bottom out of Lego. Money, money, oh, please make it stop. So stick throughout the whole video because you are not going to want to miss out on this one. All right, enough chit chat. Let's cut the intro short and hop right into this video. Alright guys, for piece number one, we're going to be adding Spongebob because this is his house, the pineapple, of course, everyone knows, so let's add him. And we're also going to be adding his pet snail, Gary. And last but not least, a little cool add-on, which is the bus Lego set. Alright guys, part number one is complete and here we have Spongebob and his pet snail Gary and also his pineapple house of course. We obviously had to use orange bricks and plates and then for the leaf part we used lots of green slow pieces and it looks awesome so far. So guys, stay tuned because you are not going to want to miss out on the rest of this mod. It is going to look amazing. So stay tuned and let's get on to the next one. Alright guys, for number two, we're going to be adding Squidward. Oh, oh, Alright guys, number two is complete and here we have Squidward in Squidward's house and my camera color changes when it looks at blue, it's just sensitive to it, so I apologize for that. But anyway, it looks amazing and guys, stay tuned because the next ones are going to be awesome. So yes, now let's get on to the next few. All right, guys, for number three, we're going to be adding Patrick because it's Patrick's house. It just makes sense. So, yes, let's add him. Is mayonnaise and I also thought it would be pretty cool to add the Flying Dutchman's Lego set. All right, guys, number three is complete. And here we have Patrick and Patrick's house, or should I say Patrick's rock or whatever you want to call it. But anyway, there it is right there. And then we also add the Flying Dutchman ship set and it just looks awesome in this. But yes, that'll do it for number three. Now let's move on to the next one. All right, guys, in order to finish off number four, of course, we have to add Mr. Krabs because it's the Krusty Krab. You just have to add him. Money, money, oh, please make it stop. And then I also thought it would be perfect to add the Paddy Wagon as well. It just suits it, I think. All right, guys, number four is complete, and here we have the Krusty Krab, which is very close to minifigure scale, in my opinion, and then we have the older set, which it just absolutely dwarfs it, probably at least four times the size, and we used tons and tons of brown pieces. I was almost close to actually running out, but we managed to build it all, and it looks amazing. And we also used some trans clear blue pieces for the windows and stuff, and it just, oh my gosh, I fell in love with the way this one looks. But anyway, that does it for the Krusty Krab. Now let's move on to the next one.
All right, guys, in order to finish number five, we're going to be adding Robot SpongeBob. Beep, boop, boop, bop, boop, boop, beep. And then we have this Krabby Patty with legs. And then we also have Patrick with poop all over his face. I love you. All right, guys, number five is complete. And here we have the best restaurant in SpongeBob. And of course, I'm talking about the Chum Bucket. But yes, here it is. I actually put it on a swivel piece so you can actually turn it around and then take a look inside, which is really, really cool because it adds Karen in there. And then we have Robot SpongeBob and then this burger Krabby Patty with legs on it. And then I thought it would also be cool to add this little car as well. But yes, that does it for number five. Now let's move on to the last piece. All right, guys, to finish this one off, we're going to be adding Mrs. Puff. And then I don't know if you guys can quite see that, but I thought it was kind of funny to add Mr. Krabs stalking on Mrs. Puff. Money! Money! All right, guys, part number six is complete, and here we have Mrs. Puff's boating school using one of the older LEGO SpongeBob sets, and it looks amazing here. But yes, here we have the starting of the course that goes all the way through, and here we have the house of the boating school, and then we have this lighthouse as well, which is just really awesome. But yes, that does it for number six, and let's add it to the piece. All right guys, part one of Bikini Bottom is complete. Now guys, stay tuned on the channel. Make sure to subscribe and put notifications on because we're gonna be adding on to this Bikini Bottom. We're gonna be making another video, adding a whole bunch of other stuff. So guys, stay tuned. That video should be up in maybe like a week or so. But yes, now let's get a moment of silence and take a quick little review of this entire masterpiece. Did you or did you not take part in various activities of zoo time merriment? Yes! And are you familiar with this peanut? Yes! Just one more question. Is it true that you were at the oyster's lair with a Mr. Patrick Starr? Yes! Yes, it's true! It's all true!